like a hell cut. Before we get started, I have a favor. If you enjoy my content and want to see me continue to improve in both quality and size, please check out my Patreon linked in the description. Any amount helps and it is greatly appreciated. There are so many rewards for each level of donation, so go check it out. Now back to the video. Welcome to Crimson Heist, and of course we had to get the battle pass in order to get access to Flores. We're not going to be talking about Flores today, I'm going to do a video on that after I get a, about a week or so to play him on live, because I didn't really get a lot of chance to do it on the TS, but we're here in today's video, we're actually going to be go going over the battle pass. So, I got the premium route because uh, I definitely won't have enough time. <clears throat> so the first award of the premium, there's no award for either's first, or for the, the first for the, the non-premium, but the premium, we get the Flores bundle, which in the Flores bundle we get, um, we get a headgear uniform for Flores, uh, but by buying it we get Flores, so, <clears throat> pretty neat. Um... We get uh, Deep Pockets, which looks like a, a kind of a, a Bitcoin of some sort. Uh, it's a charm. Uh, banknotes. This is really nice. Uh, this is actually a really nice skin. I really like it. We get a Renown Booster. Uh, alpha Pack. Tall Grass. This one's actually really nice. I really like this one. This one's one of the better ones. Uh, we get more currency. Um... <clears throat> We get Yana Silver Bombshell uh, headgear, which are these nice glasses. I like them. Um, we get Tall Grass Attachment Skin. Less noticeable, but it's it, it's cool. I like it. We get um, Reticulated, Reticulated Squad Mate. Um, this is the uniform, so it's the uniform he's wearing right now. Uh, pretty nice. I like that symbol on his uh, shoulder. <clears throat> uh, we get the snake skin weapon skin, which is of course for um, Legion. We get the Legion Reptilla uh, uh, charm, universal charm, uh, renown booster, R6 credits. We get the ocular scales, which these look really. This is actually really nice headgear. I feel like the the headpiece is the eyes a little too far apart. It just kind of looks weird. Um, I said that's pretty fine. I don't know why he has that. If he has that on, it's kind of weird. But oh well. <clears throat> alpha pack, alpha pack. Um, Norm Defer? Defi Defi Norm Defire? I think that's Norm Defire. I've never, I, I've actually never seen the word Defire before, so I don't know. Uh, it's really nice. It's ba it's same basic shape as her uniforms are generally. Um, but it is, it is pretty cool. I do like the texturing on her arms and um, on her legs. You can kind of see it here. Uh, on the inside areas. It's really nice. We get the gold dice, which is uh, another charm. Snake skin. This one is for <clears throat> um, Aruni and Muzzy for the, the Roni. Get a black gear, black geared, black beard. Um, it's called plain sight. It's, okay, his beard kind of looks like it doesn't mesh well with his skin tone. It just looks like it's fake on him. I'm not sure why. Um, we get slick professionalism, which is a um, Wimai and IQ weapon skin for the Og. <coughs> the Og A2. Uh, we get informal cover up. For uh, Blackbeard. Really uh, kind of basic, but I like it. We get uh, well, my headgear, um, multi spectral, uh, multi spectral glasses. It's interesting, I guess. I'm not really the biggest fan of it, though. More off packs. We get a Rooney, uh, reticulated squad mate. So it looks like this battle pass, it's two separate squads. It's more of a or I guess there is this squad, and then there's the people that aren't part of the squad. I really wonder what her headgear looks like. 
Um, cause I, <laughs> she might end up looking like Viper from, um, <clears throat> Valorant. You get the cartography skin, uh, weapon skin for one of Blackbeard's weapons. We get the super agent skin for Wamai. I do like this. This with his normal headgear, I think is going to be cool. Um, we get the uh, Rooney, uh, Reptilla. Yes, she very much looks like Viper from, um... Valorant ocular scales. Yeah, she very much looks like Viper. Is that Alibi? That is Alibi. Uh, more Alpha Packs and Kaid. Um, we got the Alibi uh, throwback uh, hoops. It's really nice headgear. We do have a lot of headgears that show her face. This one's really nice. Um, or her full face without her visors on, I should say. Uh, we get this one. It's the other. Snake skin looking one. This one is for Kaid, of course. Uh, Eel Trinket uh, Charm. Uh, big Cat Charm. Then we get the uh, Alibi <coughs> the Golden Tracksuit. So I, so it, what it's looking like is uh, there's some skins for just individual operators, but then there's like this, this squad skin for certain other operators, which is so far it's Legion, um, it is a Rooney, and it's Kaid. Precious ingot. You know what? This is a heist thing. It has to be a heist thing. Because there's blueprints. There's casual stuff. There's blueprints. And then there's like thieves. Like this is 100% something to deal with a heist. 100%. Heist role playing. <laughs> um, with the Kaid Reptilla. We get the Concealed Identity Headgear for Ace. We get uh, roulette, roulette Wheel for uh, Kaid and Fuse. Er, for Ace and Fuse. Um, we get the Lucky Chip. Uh, this is, of course, Ace's, but... Uh, we get Snake Skin for Kaid's Weapon. We get the Handyman for um, Ace. See, this is definitely undercover uh, heist stuff that they're going to be having. I think it's pretty cool. Uh, we get Bandit Band. That's the next one to get the uh, Ocular Scales headgear. So he's going to be part of that team too. This one I actually do really like. I really like this one. I don't, I don't care about the eyes being separate. I like that one. Alpha Pack. Um, we get this. Once again, a more casual look for uh, Goyo. I could not remember his name for a second. Shaved lines. Um... Snake skin for Bandit and Jaeger, but it is specifically for Bandit. We get his... I forgot I had that skin on him. Uh, this is the uh, Bandit uniform. Renown booster, Alpha Pack, Alpha Pack. Eye catcher for uh, Goyo and Mira, but specifically for Goyo because it, he's the one that has it. Um, yes. Definitely a more. Ca th this is 100% a heist role play. They're 100% doing a heist role play. Business cash. They are 100% doing business cosplay or uh, role play. Um, what did I say? Business cosplay. Is that what I'm saying? Um, heist role play. Uh, I'm definitely going to have. Th these are the skins I'm going to have equipped. I, I like all these ones. Blue hood. Blue, uh, mm, blue hued camo. This one is for Bandit. Or... I don't think this one is going to be the one that's for Bandit because it kind of doesn't match the rest of it. This is most likely the one that's for um, Zero. Because I've seen him somewhere else in this. Uh, Nomad is part of this squad too. Um, upscaled Cigar Holder. Uh, Charm. Credits. Alpha Pack. There's 100 tiers in this one, so. Another alpha pack. Blue, 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 blue hued camo. Oh my gosh. <laughs> um, You know, this might be for Bandit, but I definitely think it's probably more for Zero. Um, Strategic Shades, Pulse. Uh, Bandit, uh, Reptilla, Charm. Snakeskin, weapon for Nomad. Booster, Alpha Pack, Ocular Scales. 
I actually really like this headgear. This is probably the, the best of this headgear set. Four of a kind. For Ace, of course. <clears throat> uh, card champion. You can't tell me that this isn't some sort of heist role play. Uh, we get Nomad, uh, Reptila. She's part of the team too, Kavera is part of the team. Snake skin for Kavera's weapon. Booster. No limits charm. Alpha pack, alpha pack. Brilliant cut for Zero. Yes, yeah, so Zero's getting a bunch of skin. This looks like it's trying to be blue ice, but it's diamond. Or black ice, but it's diamond. It's diamond. Brilliant cut. So yeah, um, Zero is definitely the, he's the mob boss of all of this. Uh, the Kavera, Reptila, uh, Alpha Pack, Renown Booster. Senior Cosmopolitan. I like that headgear. Um, ocular Scales, I like the face makeup for this one. Yeah. Yeah, it's definitely a role play. Or are we going to get an actual heist event? That'd be really cool. Um, old Gig's Wage. Oh, cool. It's his logo except out of emeralds or something. That's pretty nice. Alpha Packs. Um, Silas pick for um, Am uh, Amaru. Yeah, this is 100% highest roleplay. Even Fink is getting in on it uh, for the ocular scale skin. Um another currency uh, uh, charm booster red carpet look for uh, Amaru Fink, uh, Finka's uh, Reptilla Alphapack, Alphapack her squad mate uniform Hout Hout Couture uh, I don't I don't know what that what that means or if I'm pronouncing it right for um Amaru Alpha Pack The Big Gun for uh Pulse so this is the one that went with the Pulse skin Renown Booster Alpha Pack Snake Skin for Finca This is my least favorite of them so far but it's still fine Uh Champion Memorial uh, credits, alpha pack, animality, I think is what it says, or um, Ace's weapon. I think there was a attachment skin that goes with Ace's other skin. Uh, we get Castle's uh, street smart uniform. He's huge shoulders. Hold on, we'll go back. He has huge shoulders. <laughs> That's 100 percent I'm trying to keep the silhouette though. Luxury goods. This one is for Flores. Alpha pack booster. Uh Honcho, which is just his headgear. Alpha pack. Lockpick. Charm. I like that actually. Uh animality for um Ace. I can never remember his name. Credits. Luxury clip, I like that one too. Uh, first class burglary, this is an attachment skin. It's all different cards. I really like that. I just was, we have two card characters. We have Flores and we have Ace. Um, freelancer for Flores, I like this. Yeah, I like it. High fashion. And then first class burglary weapon skin. All awesome. So this is 100% uh, a high stroke play. So if we go to, so so we have two cards, and we got them both really close in proximity. We have Ace, whose thing is literally cards. I'm assuming if Flores had come first, his would literally have been a card. Um, but yeah. What do you guys think, though? For free, tell me your opinions in the comment section down below. Uh, as always, thank you all for watching. Okay. It 100% said one difficulty. It 100% says one difficulty here. That's a bit of an inconsistency. Because it clearly says he's too difficult to hear. All right, well, whatever. Thank you all for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe for more content. Follow my social skewer. Channel, Discord, join the conversation, Patreon. If you feel like supporting me, this is Matt, the Emerald Avenger. Have a very nice day. Stay safe. Peace out.